Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be about this eye look. I use the Missy Lynn palette and as I said before in another video of mine, I am trying to get more into makeup and trying different eyeshadow looks and stuff. Just try it just to see. I am not a makeup artist, I am a makeup enthusiast. So if you want to see how I achieve this look, stay tuned. So this is going to be a bit of a talk through. I'm going to be using the Missy Lynn palette. And as you can see, I've completed this eye here. So let's get started. So I'll first be using this orange tone. I'm going to use that in my crease to warm up my crease. You see me looking down, I'm looking in a mirror down here. So going to sweep it through the crease the windshield wiper here yep. next I'm going to use this light purple and I'm going to put the light purple right on top of the orange gonna give like a little bit of an ombre effect. And then on the outer corners, I'm gonna put this brown. I'm not gonna blend this in this time, I'm just gonna dab it right on the outer corners. Right on top of that with Embark from MAC. It's my favorite, favorite eyeshadow for blending. So we're gonna go right over where I just put that brown. Give it some definition. And so then we're gonna go in with this color. It's supposed to be a bronzer, but I decided to use it as an eyeshadow. And I'm gonna spray my brush off with this mineralized water. It makes the um, eyeshadow have more pigment when you put it on. It makes it really, really bright when you put it on. And I'm not gonna sweep or anything. I'm just gonna dab it from the palette and tap it right on my eyelid. Cause I want it to, I'm gonna do it in layers, build it up, and that way it's brighter. Came with Embark and I'm going to blend the corners so it's not so harsh like this. I'm just going to blend just a tiny bit on each side.
eyeliner on the bottom lid. I normally don't put mascara on the back of my lashes, but because I use this shimmery color, it is all over my lashes. So I'm going to go on the back of my lashes first to make them black and then get that glitter off the back of them. take a lot of time on my lashes because I don't wear false lashes so I have to take my time and work on my lashes then I'm gonna follow up with this mascara I almost forgot to put a highlighter under my brows, so let's make that happen. And I'm gonna be using this. to my little trick. Anybody who's been watching my videos knows this is my trick for making my blush stand out more. And this is the same eyeshadow that I use for this look. It's Embark from MAC. And I'm just gonna go along my cheek line, put that there. And it helps the blush stand out more. You just wanna sweep it right here around the ball of the cheek and stop right here. Don't come out any further. So since we're in the bronzy mood, I'm gonna go ahead and top it off with this Ambering Rose Blush from MAC. So I'm just gonna do it lightly. Because I don't want anything to show out more than my eyeshadow. I want my eyeshadow to be the showstopper. So just a little bit. Make a little bronzy there. And on to the lip. I'm gonna do a little bit of a nude lip. I think that would be good for this look. So this is Night Moth from MAC. And I'm just gonna put it on lightly because this is really a deep purple and I just wanna put it on a little bit light. And I'm holding my pencil sideways because when you do it that way, it um, smudges the lip liner. If you do it sharp like this, it's gonna leave a line. You know, we all hate those lines. So you're gonna hold it sideways and just sweep across there. So I'm going in with Taupe from MAC. It's a nude lipstick and it is matte. So you don't need a lot, just a little bit. Then I'm gonna go on top of that with Marvelous Moxie from Bare Minerals. I'm just gonna put a light coat of it and the name of it is Birthday Babe.
And there you go.